Alrighty, we are going to be reacting to Monaga vs. Just Gamer, FRB vs. Anything. I just saw this appear in my sub box, I was like, you know, that kind of makes sense, because in FRB vs. Anything, it's literally just a rap battle creator versus something that's similar to them. In this case, it is the difference, the correlation here is that Just Gamer controls, or owns rather, FRB vs. Anything. He's the one who creates these, so the... The, he controls everything just like Monica does. He, she's in control of the computer code of the DDLC. I've done a lot of Monica bas battles recently, so you should, pr if you've seen those, you should probably get the gist of how this is gonna work. So you should, you should understand a lot of the Monica bars, but well, I'll still explain them. That's like the whole point of why, <laughs> of why I'm doing these. Uh, but also, this is a raw reaction. I've never seen this before, so. I've been saving it for quite a bit. What was it January 4th? And today is the 12th when I'm recording this? Yeah. Uh, it's been a while. I, I saw in the sub box, I was like, oh, I gotta watch that. Uh, not yet, though. <laughs> so, it's been a while since this came out, but I really want to see it, so. Can't wait. FRB versus anything, dude. Manica. Just Gamer. Hey. Oh. Can you hear me? Okay, that's a start. I know this isn't the matchup you all really wanted for Gamer, and since I aim to make everyone happy, I'm willing to sit this one out and change the code to make this battle what you all want. What? Give me a sec to rework this here. Hold on. First off, I recognize who this is. Oh, I know this. Who is this? I know this voice. I know this voice. Oh, who is Garbage Gothic? This is Garbage Gothic. Let's go. What a good, what a good VA for Monica. Uh, but also. <laughs> Dewey Monica rapper. Add new rapper. This is interesting. Oh, and something I should note right now. I don't know what's happening with my camera, but you can see over here I've got like a we some weird light problems that's happening with the window. So that's why that light's turn off right now is it's like bugging out and I don't know why. So you gotta have to ignore the random splotches of light that's appearing all over me. But uh, give me a sec to rework this here. Why do people not want Monica versus Gamer? I don't see the problem with it. Let's see Change the beat. It's a different battle. This is weird. Who is it now? <gasps> Camera! That's cool. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, well. I thought this was going to be a Monica battle, but I guess not. Oh no, and now I'm not gonna understand any of the bars, dude, because I don't- I haven't seen or played anything Danganronpa yet, I still have yet to do that, so... Oh well, I don't- <laughs> I don't know what to expect now. Hmm, it's, it's really funny. discovers her opponent, and it's some lowly child trying to topple me, who seems to be what would happen if the ultimate imposter was feebly copying Benny. No. <laughs> Wait, so first off, so what I do know off the top is- this is this character's name in Danganronpa is literally named Ultimate Imposter, which is pretty funny for all you Among Us people. Uh, and this is Benny, uh, Snakebite126. Uh, <laughs> it's pretty funny so far. Uh, Interesting. It's punishment time! Okay, good good, good opener so far. I like this. <laughs> I, I'm not going to understand any of the Danganronpa stuff, which makes me sad, but it's so funny that opens as Monica versus Just Gamer, and then switches. It's like, sorry, you know what? This is actually not what people wanted to see. So we're just going to... All right, different person. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay. DRB. Discord rap battles? Does he run that? I don't know if he runs. I don't know who runs that. So he might run that. I don't know who Interesting. Oh. Oh, it's the Chiaki Nanami's execution, I believe, was getting you crushed, right? And then crushing gamers, like just gamer. Very cool. Begin it's him! Dude, ca camera for battles like this is always sick. 
before we begin, remind me which version of you I'm against? It's all such a blur. The psycho that wanted to lose her mind or the sister profusely defends her. It's the one you're okay. obsessed with brainwashing. Your mind is tainted with painting the world in despair, but you're far from right. There wasn't black and white unless discussing the lives stolen by your plush bear. Hey, because the plush bear is black and white. That's like the color scheme. Very cool so far. Your story, you get crushed. That was your defeat. But in real Ooh. life, you get crushed with masochistic weebs and just a <laughs> and they zoom in on Peter for that as well. It's pretty self-explanatory though. I don't have to explain that, but it's pretty funny. I like that. Simple tip between you and me. I'd advise against calling your own fans creepy. Oh. That's pretty interesting. That's pretty cool. Cause he's saying he's because that's a weird way. It's not weird. That's an interesting way of saying I'm a fan of your series, but it's kind of a it's kind of, it's just between you and me. It's kind of kind of wrong, right? To just go and insult your fans like that. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Rap belt, just give me Scott the rhyme sleeve, dismantled hey? again, blinded without eyes, this fashion hey? tried to put the hot and psychotic, but the fans of your fame out cold. <laughs> inside hot inside psychotic, the fans left your fame Not out cold. Oh, okay. Oh, that's it. Okay. Uh, who's winning that? It's interesting because I'm still kind of twisted on the idea that Monica was supposed to be in this, but it's not anymore. So, who is winning? Just Gamer versus Junko. Junko had... Uh, it's close, actually, which is the first for an FRB. I believe that this is the first time in, in an FRB versus anything that uh, it's actually close, as opposed to it being like more leaning towards the FRB person, obviously, because... Otherwise, you're just kind of making it to diss yourself. <laughs> so, granted, I haven't seen a whole ton of the FRB versus anything. So I should probably go see some more of those because helps me get a better taste of who the of like who these people are and how they how they work. Uh, it gives me a better taste of how all the FRB creators rap. It's pretty awesome. Your overwhelming sense of hope because it's doing okay. nothing to leave me amused. You remind me of me that I'm spending precious time on editing projects, leaving yourself abused. Wow. That's a good comparison, if I'm being honest. Uh, that that would be, because that's a pretty good comparison right there from Junko. You could probably have gotten away with uh, that this this matchup with who is this again? I need a reminder. Uh, da, mia, mit, miterai, miterai, miterai. Uh, so that's pretty that's pretty interesting. I was spending precious time on uh, the editing project. Oh, you probably wow. Down my you're already scared of girls. It's a waste of space. Going face to face against this is great. Because you're pushing your writing with fucking changes pace. Makes... <laughs> what was that face? Okay. Uh, that was, a, that was a mild round. It was a mild round. Like, you opened up really nice, and then you were just sort of like, yeah, light punch here, a little jab there, as opposed to like. The full blow over of the comparison to meter eye like that was that was a good that was a good comparison right there but uh that was a decent second round very beatable i'm gonna i'm i think just gamer is gonna win this if he has anything to say about dang and rampa right now since they battled harley quinn i say that oh. you're both clown this <laughs> <laughs> that's pretty funny uh, but also that battle is a swizzky battle that's pretty cool nice uh, was it called CBRB comic book rap battles East versus West? That was like the most popular one was Junko versus uh, uh, Harley Quinn. So very cool reference. Master Coda will overload her. Ooh. Take a program and shut it down. And it's very cool editing. You board. You face mass destruction with a muscle numbness with all the personalities you got across the board. You turn Ooh. DID to spare infused dumbness. To despair infused dumbness. DID. Uh. I didn't get the rhyme there. Let me go back again. Program and shut it down. And it's a surprise battle leaves you bored. You face mass destruction with the muscle numbness with all the personalities. You got across the board. You turn DID to despair and dumbness. dumbness. To despair and views dumbness. All right, cool. I like that. Morrison Hope's Peak Academy. I'll have you know. Ooh, because Hope's Peak Academy explodes, right? Yeah. Okay. Nice. A guy who can't swim. It seems too easy to drown you in flow. He can't swim? Oh no, dude. Too lazy to execute your own plans. You use child suicides to make a difference. But you got one thing right. Your birth was the biggest, most atrocious incident. What is the biggest, most atrocious incident? Is that a episode reference? I don't get that one. This is verse four. Okay. I mean, granted, they're doing a little bit of a back and forth right here, but like, this is verse four. Huh. And the first minute was taken up with... Yeah, about the first, approximately the first minute, yeah, was taken up by Monica saying, uh, bye, <laughs> gonna put this person in place. 
Game over, just gamers getting just desserts with bar so sweet. What? Hold on. What? Also, ow, F. I'm sorry. <laughs> Chocolate allergy. It's good, good writing, good writing. <laughs> You're just a newcomer that got that just got super super egotistical because it got one nice comment from eddie <laughs> that's pretty funny uh wow okay this is a good round for junko for sure Wow. Started off as someone who unsurprisingly came out of the ERB Reddit, who can't even handle one series at a time and give the DRB crew their proper credit. <laughs> wait, no, dude. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I remember this guy. What was his name? Because obviously he's dressed up as uh, Atticus Finch, right? Uh, what? He also he does run Discord rap battles, so he does FRB versus anything on his main channel as well as Discord rap battles. That's very interesting. Uh, what is this called? Uh, Smash Bros. V anything, I, what, is it, I don't remember that one. I don't think I was there for that, but, ah, oh, wow. Members of the ultimate despair couldn't bear to survive once I was gone, but every team bear, bear to survive. doesn't really need you. No, that's wrong! <laughs> no, that's wrong! <laughs> the comeback. The fire dude? Okay. Uh, you gotta, you gotta come back. You got come back, gamer. Dude, that was a lot against you. And it got personal, too, with the chocolate allergy. And, oh, wow. Yeah, that was her best round by far. You have to pull back a lot right now. Even during your childhood. You already used the execution line as well. You don't have that in your arsenal anymore. You didn't belong anywhere. The tragedy was your only purpose. And time all okay. in ahead of you, yet you decided to render it worthless. Okay. You obsessed with the boy who you thought understood you like no other. Then you grieved your sand castle just to prevent from grieving over his mother. Now he's Ooh. dead by your hands no less, but you can never run a play at all on your own. First, this to your biggest fan, treat every ally like a stepping stone. Tell wow. Tom putting a stop to this joke. Put the match up in the ultimate nihilist. I know you probably enjoyed losing, but sorry, Junko. I'm finally ending this. <laughs> Wait, did he die? Did he freaking die? <laughs> Look at him. Look, he's dead. <laughs> oh no. Oh no! I oh no! I I'm I'm torn because I think he might have lost. Oh hold on, let me let it play out. Who's next? You decide. Uh, dude, look at that. Better be you versus Junko. Just gamer versus Junko. Why is Junko v gamer a thing? <laughs> gamer v Junko. Shut up. <laughs> Who won? I see. I feel. Oh, there was so much in Junko's final verse. It was pretty much head-to-head, -head, like, like, really close the entire time. And then right at the end, Junko had a long verse, and it was great. And then, uh, and then there was, he, I'm uh, not, not denying Gamer said some stuff right at the end, but, like, he had, like, half, half the verse time at the last bit, and then literally ended with, I'm ending this, and then literally dies. So, uh, I, I feel bad for saying this, but I think Junko may have won. Oh. Ow. R. R. B. Versus. Anything. Okay. Gareth himself. Wait, I want to see the microphone. Look at the microphone. I think I have the same microphone, but pink back at home. That's pretty funny. Uh, Jesse Box was Junko. Nice. That's a good VA. That's a good VA for Junko. And Gareth himself. That's really cool. He even has the shirt. I just realized he has the exact same shirt as in his, uh, or uh, it's close. It's almost the exact same shirt as his, uh, his thing, which is hilarious. I love that. Monokuma was Cameron. I'm I was right about Monica. It was Garbage Gothic. Let's go. All right. Do, do, do. He did all of the writing. Okay, that makes sense. Because that means, that makes sense why it, that, why my belief for Gamer losing and Junko winning 
makes sense. It's like, if you're writing a rap battle all, all to yourself, about yourself, you don't want to seem egotistical by making yourself win. Uh, honestly, in my opinion, the only way you can make it sound really egotistical is if it was a complete landslide, one-sided, the seesaw looked like this. But, uh, the problem is, it seemed, it seemed almost the opposite. It seemed like it was leaned way the other direction, like, for, like, it seemed like a gamer lost by, not a long shot, but, like, a decent margin. Like, it, so... I guess I guess he was trying to avoid looking egotistical by making him seem like he won, uh, but it's it's mm, I would have been okay with it if if it was if you did win by quite a bit, but it doesn't seem like it. I'll ha I'll be rewatching it in the ed editing because this is a long video for analyzing, but I don't know. <laughs> Edited by Gamer and Fight Marker, well done, Swiss Key for inspiring me. That's cool. Additional feedback by Cree. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I want to give everyone the credit where credit's due. Zagranis dancing glitch through the Zagranis again. <laughs> Very cool. Hey, it got a groove to the good instrumental as well. Hint? 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 What a f***ing nerd! <laughs> We're ending on that. Subscribe <laughs> Subscribe to Just Gamer. Is that 172? Can we go to 175 maybe? No, oh, I don't know what number to pick at this point, but that's that's hilarious. Okay, have a Merry Christmas, people. <laughs>